Hey, you, are you okay, sir? I don't think you're feeling very good. You know, maybe maybe you shouldn't leave after all. Maybe you just stay here for just a little bit longer. Why don't you take a nap? Don't worry. There's plenty of more stuff to see at DVCB Exotics. My name is Dakota Burke. On April 7th, 2022, I took a free spot in a reptile room tour hosted by DVCB Exotics. I've been a prisoner with them ever since. I... I don't know what happened. One minute I'm looking at a blue-tongued skink, the next minute they came out of nowhere, grabbing, shoving me, and that's when I woke up here. Where am I? What the fuck? Dude, come on! Let, let me out of here, man! What, what, what do you think you're doing here? Just let me go! What's happening? Silly mortal, there's no leaving DVCV Exotics. I mean, you're gonna be working with these reptiles for the rest of your miserable life. Or we can get you in with those reptiles, it's time to go to the Happy Reptile Boot Camp. Let's get going. No, no, I, I don't want to go to the boot camp. No, get, get away from me! Get away! The Reptile Boot Camp. They said it was to teach us how to take care of the reptiles. But that wasn't it. No, that wasn't it at all. They were trying to break us mentally through the utmost torturous psychological warfare I have ever imagined in my life. No, please, please make it stop. Ah! Torture went on for two, two days. <laughs> A man can only take so much Doo doo sharks for so many hours before it completely breaks you down. After the Sunshine Happy Camp, they moved you into the main breeding room with the geckos. We called it level one. There used to be three of us. There was me, Bakoda, and Chad. God, I've always felt bad for Chad. That poor soul got the worst of all of it. Well, hey there! These token gecko tanks look absolutely dog shit! What the fuck do you think you're doing, Chad? <laughs> what, you think because you're a rock, that makes it okay to slack off more than the rest of you? Oh, well if that's the mindset of this happy camper, then we've got a special thing for something just like you. How about a little refresher on what it means to be a good soldier? Let's get you in there now. <laughs> Hey, hey, come on, man. I, I, I think he's had enough. Don't... come on. What did you say to me? N nothing, sir. Nothing, sir. I I'm getting back to work. Yep. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. He didn't survive it. That monster went on for hours, shaking that poor man in that tiny, tiny box until he stopped moving. You want to know what the worst part is? They didn't take him out. They just left him there. Said it was a reminder to keep us in check. They just left that poor man in this room while we worked. After that, it was just business as usual with me and the other guy that has a name that sounds really similar to me and looks just like me, but he wears a hat. Weeks went on with nothing, just awfulness, working 23 hours a day, getting nothing to wear but this awful, awful shirts. It's their merch. They sell these things right on the bottom where the little store banner is. That's all we were able to wear. That's just how it was. And the food. 
don't get me started on what they fed us. It's food day, gentlemen. Now make sure every last gecko gets their deli cup because we don't want anyone missing out. Please, man, we're so hungry. We haven't eaten in days. We need food. Oh, not to worry, little campers. I know you guys are hungry. We made a special cup just for you. Oh, but it's papaya. Eat it. Don't waste a single drop. <laughs> so many Crescent Gecko Deli Cups I had to eat. They might smell good. They don't taste good. Now, I always knew something wrong was going on here. These people, you can't do these things to humans and not be some kind of monster. But that's when I found out what they really were during the incident. That's it, man! I've had enough of this! I'm done being your slave and claiming over all these animals! I've had enough! Let me out of here! I'm done doing work for you! Oh, insubordination. <laughs> we have the thing just for you. Get on over here. And all you had to say is you didn't want to be here anymore. Don't worry, we'll set you free. We'll set you free right now. Hope you have fun in the eternal darkness. <laughs> <laughs> Please, I'll still be good. I'll be good. Ah, ah, ah. Did you also want to be free of your meat shell? No, 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 sir. No, get, oh, getting right to it. Okay. I mean, it all made sense after that. The way he's treating us, how he's able to do a full-time business while only having only like 100 animals and 17,000 subscribers on YouTube. There's no way any mere person could do this. That's the day I found out that DBCB Exotics is the devil himself. That was the day I knew I had to get out of here. I wasn't going to be released. I had to get out from hell itself. Since I'm the last human that survived level one, I've now been getting promoted to what they call Grotopia. I'll be getting shipped off tonight. And that's when I know I'm going to be making an escape. It's an isolated place. He doesn't go there all the time. This is my one and only chance to get out of here. I'm going to show you guys how I escaped hell itself and how I tricked the devil. Okie dokie, sir. Right this way. Where, where are you taking me? Doki, sir, you can take the blindfold off now. Welcome to your new home. What the fuck? Where, where am I? <laughs> Silly Dakota, it's all grow tense in Grotopia. I hope you enjoy. In there now, go we'll let you out in the morning when it's time for work. Wait, you can't just lock me in here. No, no. I've been in this grow tent for eight hours now. <laughs> The mylar reflecting material has almost completely blinded me. I just heard the door close. No one else is in here anymore. These fucking morons. Grow tents are so delicate. Anyone can break out of these. It's the easiest enclosure to break out of. This is it, guys. This is where I make my escape. <laughs> I'm getting out of here tonight, boys. No more crested gecko food. No more crested gecko food. <laughs> oh, we're getting out tonight, boys. Looks like they turned off the lights. I'm guessing no one else is here. My god, this place is disgusting. It's like they just throw their trash at the bottom of this building instead of throwing it out like human people would with actual common sense. Jesus Christ. There's the door. <laughs> Fuck, it's locked. There's gotta be another way out of here. Wait, what's that? 
Stairs. There's stairs. We can get out of here. What was that? It's like sealed. There has got to be an exit in there. Why else would they seal this off? This has to be the way out. <laughs> I'm going to be free. I'm going to be free. <laughs> I can move it. <laughs> We're getting out of here, boys. We're getting out. It's pitch black in here. I can't, I can't see anything. What was that? Yes. Guys, I can't see anything. I don't... I, I don't... I don't know. I... I... Where's, where's the door? There's gotta... There's gotta be a... There's gotta be a door somewhere. I... No. No. <laughs> there's something up here. Yeah, I'm actually uh, pulling up to the place right now. It's so strange. It was just some weird coupon that hit my email for a free reptile room tour. So I might as well just take it. Maybe he's got some cool stuff. But uh, yeah, I just pulled up. I gotta, gotta let you go. Guess I just knock on the door. Oh, ho ho! Well, hey there! Welcome to DVCB Exotics! Why don't you guys come on in? Trust me, you're gonna have the best time of your life. You'll love it so much that you will never want to leave.